This video is for the girlies who need an alternative and their skin cannot handle retinol. I got you. If you're new here, I'm a skincare chemist. I help you answer your skincare questions. So if you're interested in science-based skincare, make sure to like below and subscribe to the channel. Let's talk about retinol alternatives. Okay, you guys, I get questioned all the time in my DMs, in my messages. My skin can't handle retinol. It's just not working. What else can I use, girl? Like, I can't deal with this retinol that's constantly breaking me out. It's constantly just ripping my skin apart. The purging, my skin cannot do it. I got you, sis. Okay, before we even get started i'm not here to bash retinol i'm not going to tell you retinol is bad i'm just going to give you my recommendations to what you can do if you don't think that you can handle retinol and we're talking about retinol the retinol that will convert into retinaldehyde and then convert into tretinoin in the skin because our skin cells have what that's right if you go to april Bass university which i'm sure you guys all do because you're on this channel our skin cells have receptors for retinoic acid not retinol so if you feel like you don't want to deal with the conversion steps then let's talk about other alternatives okay first retinol you guys know i love retinol I've talked about retinol in this video. I talked about my top retinols. Retinol is such a great alternative because it just has one conversion step into tretinoin. It's gentle, works even faster than retinol. It's just such a great alternative because it does everything retinol does and even better. Retinol is that big sister that will show you the way that will get you where you need to get faster than the little sister can. The product I love in this category is Murad's Retinol Resculpt. Number two, Bacuccio, the plan derived version of retinol. This is basically a more chill sister to retinol. It's like we can hang, okay? You can tell me your boring stories i'll listen to you you don't have to pretend around me if you feel like retinol is just too much for you because you will get you where retinol will get you at a much slower pace but it'll get you there like i said she's the chill sister right she doesn't do things in a hurry at this point you already know what retinol does i don't have to tell you guys you guys know right comment below the functions of retinol on the skin if retinol takes about two to three months to work give bakucho about six months to really see the effects a product i love in this category for my girlies in a budget is inculus one percent bakucho another option is great active retinoids although these ones are still being studied they're esters of retinoin they're over the counter they work very similarly to prescription grade retinol if you feel like you don't want to commit 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 to prescription grade retinol the ordinary has a lot of these another option before committing to a prescription would be adapalene this one actually used to be prescription but now baby it is over the counter and different is the one that tiktok girlies and honestly skincare girlies have been eating up so definitely try those two now this one's for my girlies who just kind of just want to go into hanging out with the big boys you want to bum bop you want to chew with the big boys <laughs> This one is obviously our prescription tretinoin. This is the Oga at the top. You feel me? You catch my drift? This one will get you where you need to go in about a month. A month and maybe a couple weeks at best. But this one, she's the girl you want to be hanging out with. She's the it girl, okay? Now, I know a lot of people don't want to go to dermatologists. A lot of you guys probably don't even have access to dermatologists. There's online dermatologists that you actually can get tretinoin from, like usually You can go on there. There's professionally trained dermatologists that will access your skin, tell you if what you really need is even retinol. Because if you have those really deep set wrinkles and dark spots do you really need treadmill and you might need laser i'm just saying you know, as much as i want to help you guys out i want to be real with you guys you might not need a topical product so it might actually be better for you to go see a derm let them examine your skin let them tell you what you really need maybe you don't even need a retinol maybe you need a different topical or maybe you need to go into the office and get a procedure done so yeah i think that's it for me for this video let me know if you guys are retinol lovers or are you like averse from retinol what are your thoughts about retinol i've actually never asked you guys that do you guys actually like retinol on this channel yeah let's talk about that is retinol your friend or not are you like Nah, I can't do this anymore. Let me know down in the comments and let's chat, okay? If you liked the video and found it valuable, make sure to hit the like button for me, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Love ya. Bye.